Hi, I'm Tom Handel with another CTN member highlight, and I'm also here with Tianda Hall, the Director of Literacy Volunteers of Greater Portland, a program of Learning Works. And we're here to talk about a special event that's coming up to celebrate Literacy Volunteers' 40th anniversary. Is that right? That's true. So to begin with, Tianda, what for people who might not know, although it's hard to believe anybody wouldn't know, what is Literacy Volunteers? Uh, Literacy Volunteers is a community-based education program that um, focuses on providing uh, literacy uh, instruction and English language acquisition instruction to people on a, a more individual level. So we do one-on-one -on -one tutoring. We have some very small groups that meet um, all over the city. This is a very important function and it's been going on for 40 years now, hasn't it? It has been, yeah. So for 40 years, uh, members of the community have been volunteering with this organization to help uh, other community members learn uh, the skills that they need in order to be successful in life and live independently and successfully and, uh, and, and enjoy all the benefits that we all enjoy through reading. Now, you're planning a very special kind of event, a very interesting kind of event yes. to, for the 40th anniversary. Could you talk about that a little? Yes, so we are planning a team trivia challenge. Um, the goal of the event is to raise funds for the program. Um, the trivia event will highlight some of the different areas of instruction and learning that our students partake in. And so we'll be quizzing people to see if they know these things. Um, the things that you actually teach. The things that we actually teach in our program, yes. So uh, how, if, if I was putting a team together, like how, well, how would I decide whether or not we'd even be, you know, uh, competitive in this kind of a challenge? Well, I think that um, it's, I think everybody is going to be competitive. Some of the questions are, are going to be questions that all of us know the answers to. Others will be um, a little bit trickier. Um, and I think that, uh, I think for, for anybody um, who's participating, there's a level of difficulty. If you've got people in your, uh, in your pocket who are eager to support community programs and who are excited about reading and literacy and trivia even, then that's really all they need to do to put a team together is, is be willing and fill out a registration form. And, and where and when is this happening? This is happening um, on October 10th here in Portland at the Ryan's Auditorium at the Portland Library um, in the afternoon from 2 until 4. Okay, so people, if they're working, would um, need to... Uh Oh, is it during the week, work week? It's during the work week. That's a Thursday. What we're hoping is that um, people um, will join as teams from perhaps their offices, from their companies and organizations, um, so, that, so that this is in some part a team building experience and activity for them. They can all do together. Have you ever done anything like this before? No, this is the first time we're doing it, and we're doing it really to support uh, the, the fact that this program is, is really kind of hit a milestone, which is 40 years in existence, 40 years of really great work and amazing volunteers. Um, so we thought we'd, we'd try to do something a little different this time instead of having sort of the usual thank you lunch for everyone, which we will always continue to do those. But this time we really wanted to get the community involved and folks who don't normally volunteer, maybe have not had the time to take to um, go through training and be matched up with a student. How, how many teams can you accommodate? How, how big is a team usually? You know, how, what, what are you expecting? We this? are saying that a team is going to be anything from two to six individuals. Um, we can accommodate up to 15. 15 teams? Up to 15 teams. Wow. Oh, with an audience watching and all. Well, I don't know that we're going to have an audience oh. <laughs> watching. It's all, it's all you know, the people watching are going to be your competitors, so you, you want to make sure you are you're being discreet about Have you answers. had any responses yet? To we things? have. Oh, we've yeah, had, right? yeah, we've had a really great response. Um, we'd still like to see more people get involved. Um, so that's where you come in. Okay. Well, uh, hopefully people will be watching this and, you know, learn about it and want to become involved with it. What, where do, where they go for more information or find out? For more information it? right now, they just need to call us. Our number is uh, 775-0105. Great. So if they just gave us a call and just said, I'd like to know more about the, tri the trivia challenge, then they'd probably connect them to me or any other person there at Learning Works who can answer those questions. Great. Well, thank you very much for joining us. It sounds like fun. Thanks for having me.